All right, all right, all right. The boy is back in town. The boy is back in town. All right, well, we've made it to Broadway at the beach and it's just dead. Where is everybody at? Florida. Florida? Everybody down in Florida right now? But yeah, I left Epcot last night and come to Myrtle Beach and expecting to see the beach life and it's just completely dead. Wow. Wow, am I surprised. But what I'm really surprised of is I'm at Broadway at the beach and there is not a big Christmas tree, but I see all kinds of construction going on. So that is the reason why there is no Christmas tree right here. They usually have the Christmas tree right here in front of the beast, in front of the, its sugar. They have completely tore this up over here. Uh, ben and Jerry's is getting new siding. So we're gonna go down to uh, Joe's Crab Shack and grab something to eat. And then maybe head down to the boulevard and the boardwalk. But I am, I'm liking what I'm seeing, honey. Other than besides you. <laughs> oh, thanks. But. Look at this construction right here. Big improvement. Wow. Oh. Unless I'm falling. I knew they were going to do something over here, but wow, look at this. This nice is going to be completely, well, this is just great right here. So they do have some Christmas up over towards the uh, hard rock. But check this out. Wow. Let me show you this. All new pavers. There's Build a Bear right here. But they would usually have the tree right there where that cone is at. And its sugar has got an all new, getting new frontage here. And the paving bricks go all the way up to the uh, center pier or the center walkway going across the center over into. Uh, so let's walk this way, honey. Let's go this way. Let's go towards the hard rock. But wow, I am really happy that they're doing that. It's about time. Really, really, <laughs> really needed that. I mean, all the facades in here need to be redone. Uh, so uh, I think they've got the Christmas tree down by the uh, Margaritaville is where they got the Christmas tree at this year. So we're going to walk down there and then come around by Margaritaville and the Hampton Inn towards the hangout and we'll eat at Joe's Crab Shack. So, uh, but yeah, we got some Christmas stuff up here. I think, uh, I think the uh, Christmas tree lighting got rained out this year. It did. And so they didn't have that because Nalani didn't sing in it. So they've got some, uh, that's kind of cute. Yeah, got some little. That's a beach chair out, beach Christmas. Let's see what they got on there. Merry Christmas, Broadway at the beach. Okay. But, so I was looking at Epcot last night, Spaceship Earth. Now I got the Ferris wheel. And instead of hard rock at Universal, I got a hard rock at Broadway at the beach. So, yeah, that smells something. Japanese. It does smell good. Now, are they getting something new here? It looks it like, looks uh, like they yeah, they repainted that up. No, that was Johnny Rockets. Johnny Rockets yeah. So Johnny Rockets might be getting something new in the old Johnny Rockets. That's what this sign says. Fun fact, okay, it's for the Hall of Fame. Any close, closer you'd be raising the trophy at midfield, so that's nothing to do with the restaurant. Say, you are here is a, doesn't have anything on there as far as what is there. Yeah. So, but yeah, don't see what they're putting in there. Got a big old Frosty the Snowman out there in front of Hard Rock. So let's go down here and check this tree out. 
All right, so uh, to the two gentlemen, and one of them uh, subscribed, y'all were talking about Paula Deans last night. There's Paula Deans for you. So uh, you had dinner there last year. You had a good time. You had a good dinner. But there it is. So we'll go down here and uh, see the Christmas tree here at Ripley's Aquarium. All right, so here's the uh, Christmas decorations. Looks good. Yeah, I got the uh, got the little snowman out front out here. Yeah, because they do the uh, states. Yeah. For, um, the tree for each state, remember? Tree for each state. Mm -hmm. So that one, I think, is just an yeah. American tree. Yeah. So here's your tree for Ripley's. And they got a few other things up. They got some trees on the inside here, it looks like. I don't think they have as much as they had last year, it doesn't look like. No, we're but, under but what they do have, it looks good. Got some candy canes out here at the ticket office. Let's just walk around and check out this other tree over at uh, over towards Margaritaville. Ah, right, so they don't have an elf on the shelf right here. They got an elf hanging up here on December 2023 there. So uh, there's where you get your picture taken with the elf for December and your old St. Nick envelope there. An envelope to send off. That might be something I, not, I might need to go do. I might need yeah. to, uh, there's a town, it's right on the, uh, in between Orlando and I think it's Cocoa Beach called Christmas. Everybody in Florida goes over there and sends a letter from Christmas. Florida, I believe, is what I was told. So I might, I might head that way. But I did do a little bit of exploring down there this week. Eustis was a nice little town, a little waterfront town, a little lake town up there, not too far from where I'm at. But let's go down here and see this tree here at Margaritaville, and then go over to Joe's and get us get something to eat at Joe's. All right, so here's the big tree for Broadway at the beach, and I think it's the uh, it's pretty much the exact same trees they had last year. So they didn't do a different tree this year or hanging different lights off of it or anything, but it's the uh, same tree. But yeah, it's uh, that's pretty. That works. That works for me. Let's go over towards the hangout and see what's going on over there. Walk by Hampton. Well, let's go. Let's go around. Let's go around Margaritaville here. Walk down the lower end here. Walk on the east side. All right. So that's new. It's called the Escape Game. So they must have an escape games this way. I don't know what it is. Yeah, escape room, I guess. But that used to be the uh, what was that? That was the uh, human body. the human body. But before that, when it first originally opened oh, up, I it was the uh, USS Hunley was the exhibit in there. But I love this area right here. How they've redone this. Got some kids in the pool in there in the Hampton. But this looks pretty back here. The hangout looks like it's all dressed up. Nobody playing tonight. Which I would think they'd probably have a hard time putting anybody in the seats. Mm -hmm. But we'll check out and see what's going on over here with Pop Stroke. Tiger Woods' Pop Stroke should be opening up this summer down here. Ah, well, they uh, got here too late. They're closing down. They're closing down the oldest Myrtle Beach Pavilion attraction right now. They're closing her down, locking her down. Closing the doors. Just too busy tonight. Couldn't, couldn't beat them away. Couldn't beat them away. That place didn't last too long, did it? The uh, shoe place that was in there. Yeah, I would think so. But look here, got some new buildings coming up here. Look at this. This is, yeah. Really, really. Oh, I would. That looks really nice. I like that. 
I don't know what all they're going to put in here, but this whole area right here is going to be really nice when they get all this finished up. Should be done by spring, shouldn't it, honey? Yeah. Yeah. Insomnia cookies. Coming soon. Here's where the pop stroke's going to be at. Maybe I'll bring the uh, Insta360 camera over here tomorrow and peek over, over peek over and see what's going on in there. But the hangout. Yeah, here you go. Key West. How far is Key West? Rio de Janeiro, Fiji, Montego Bay. But yeah, check these out. These buildings, these are really pretty. Yeah, conch, a conch, a conch cottage. cottage, a conch cottage. Yeah. All right. Well, let's go get us something to eat. Yep. Joe's is just right around the corner. I can see the flashing lights from here. With the arrow pointing right at. Yeah. Out. Ah, so what all do we have down there in Key West Village here? Pravadia, Insomnia Cookies, The Hangout, Guest Services, they got a Starbucks, Till Nation, and the Carousel. I do like the way they've got that. They've got this up. I like that. That looks nice. They need a, uh, need one of those big floats they have for Key West. You know the one I'm talking about? The, uh, Farthest point oh, south yeah. or something like that. The southernmost point. Yeah, they need the something. The buoy lighthouse. Yeah, thing. the buoy. They need a buoy. Need to put a buoy right there in that in that planter. Put a buoy there. Yeah. Zero gravity. Hot Jersey Nights. Hot Jersey Nights is playing again. Yeah, doing Christmas. Yeah, always doing Christmas. That's all they ever do is Christmas. <laughs> well, we're here at Christmas time. It's Christmas time. All right, so here's Joe's Crab Shack, right beside the Myrtle Beach Quickie Mart in the Simpsons 4D. Shows every 15 minutes. Bart there, working the money, taking the money. I don't know if I'd trust Bart taking money. Look at him. He's got it all lined up there, don't he? I don't trust you, Bart. But uh, here's Joe's Crab Shack. Let's go get us some, go get us some some food on here, some Myrtle Beach goodness. Ah, they got them a nice little pretty tree up here. Yeah, they got them a pretty tree up in here bar love the bar in here really like the bar bucket of crabs bucket of crabs here yeah, so we look around here this is uh, pretty pretty dead in here right now got some nice out back seating back here what they're calling Joe's playland back here you sit back here on a picnic table Got some pretty good views back over towards Paula Dean's and Ripley's Aquarium. This big old shark up here with somebody sticking out of it. Somebody's leg sticking out. I don't know what he, I don't know what he, he's having a bad day there. But yeah, they got a, this place is pretty, pretty well themed out. Got a lot of theming in here. We ate here last year, and the food was pretty good. Actually, uh, sat right there at that table right there last year. But not a lot of people here right now, as you can tell. But we're going to get the uh, shrimp shrimp sampler split it. Got to have something to tide us over for a little bit. 
Well, I'm sorry, but I was just so hungry, I just forgot to show you the food. We had some really good shrimp. What all kinds of shrimp we had? We had some shrimp that had some bacon wrapped around it. Uh -huh. Gotta go around with some grilled. Grilled, yeah, grilled and uh, bacon. Mm -hmm. And there was two more, what, right? But there was two more types of shrimp there. I can't remember what they were, uh, but they were really good. It was really good, so. Anyway, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe. We'll see you on the flip side. Remember, Myrtle Beach is calling your name.